Local news for Wednesday the 14th of October. Fonterra farmers are already among the world's most sustainable producers of milk and now they have an additional tool in the sustainability toolbox. Over the last few days, Fonterra farmers have been receiving unique greenhouse gas emissions profiles for their farms. Fonterra Director on Farm Excellence Charlotte Rutherford says one of the most important steps in improving your emissions profile is understanding where your emissions come from and that's what this report does. The three Wadded Upper Councils want your thoughts on how the region can continue to thrive. You can fill out a two-minute survey or leave your thoughts and ideas at wadadupperrecovery.nz. Nearly 1,000 people have attended events as part of Yarns and Barns so far with organisers over the moon. Yarns and Barns is Wadded Upper's festival of reading and is 50% up on the last festival of two years ago. With many more events uh, still to attend, a list of those events can be found at yarnsandbarns.co.nz. And in sport, the Mori Firm Wadded Upper Bush Club Rugby Awards were held last night. Big winners included Mark Child for Coach of the Year, Greytown for Club of the Year and Marist Peter Beach for Player of the Year. Kia ora for local news and sport, I'm Brink Gear.